Hello, welcome back to this is Indie Productions playthrough of Pokemon Emerald. We're now where we left off after outside the mall where I am still having a massive brain fart. And where to go. And those are supposed to be Willemer. <laughs> Essentially we need to go that way, but we can't get there at the moment, so we have to go do something else. This is where I forget what I'm supposed to do. I remember that, yes, Team Aqua's hideout is right here. Problem is, see, I'm putting a rappel on because I think I'm going to be seeing a lot of wild encounters. I ended up forgetting that I can't go through here right now. I do love the Aqu Team Aqua hideout theme, though. It's fun delicious. I also love how soothing the surf, the surf theme is. I know, I'm, I don't know if I noticed this before, but it's a very calming theme, to be honest. There's a Pokeball over there. does nothing. I never understood what that thing was, to be honest. It's just kind of there. Um, okay. Contest on there. And as you can see, I'm really lost by the fact that I'm going back here even after I already know. To no avail. No. Seeing as I'm kind of lost at the moment, I might as well uh, talk about something else at the moment. Um, I'm not sure if I mentioned it before, but um, in the last part, but I finally beat the main game of um, Pokemon Black. Uh, final thoughts on it were: it was a good game. Definitely has the best battle system and like best layout, like best like gameplay ever in a Pokemon game. Uh, the Pokemon selection, like I said, was lame. Um, the story was decent, it wasn't my favorite. Uh, the game's speed was really good. It's tied for second place now, it's my fa second favorite Pokemon game, behind this one. I love this game. But um, since I beat that, and I'm not going to work on the post game yet. I'm going to get back to that later. At the moment, I'm going to start do I'm actually going to start playing Pokemon Heart Gold, because I've never played Johto before. So I'm going to give that a try. I'm really hoping, though, that they remake uh, the Ruby Sapphire Emerald game on 3DS. Like they did with Leaf Fire Red, Leaf Green, and, um, Ah, uh, the magma emblem. That's that's gonna be important. But uh, like like I'm saying, like they did with Leaf Green, Fire Red, and that Heart Gold Soul Silver. I would love to see a remake of this game with the 3DS graphics. That'd be cool. As long as they get the same gameplay back, that would be awesome. This isn't right. Planet's biggest mysteries at the bottom of the sea. Huh. Hmm. That that should come in handy later. Yeah, I saw it. It's 
Ooh, I can't go in right now. Uh, yeah, it's kind of like that with every area, dude. Ah, so the Whelmer are blocking other people, too. I hate not knowing what I'm supposed to do in the game. Right now I'm actually looking through the museum. I do like this track of music too, it's very uh, convenient. It's nice and calming. I know the GBA wasn't known for its sound, but some tracks were just brilliant. Alright, so essentially we can bring this guy paintings that we find from over, and I'm not sure what he does because I never did it. I might show it off if I can figure out how it works. essentially go in here and you can get any move deleted from a Pokemon's move set, including HMs. So if you ended up teaching a Pokemon an HM, this is a good place to get rid of it. Next part we'll be getting back into some exploration. It's I just had a massive brain fart on this part. And I did had no idea where to go. This part always stumped me, it's just because of how cryptic it is. You like have to do something that you would never think to do otherwise. 